Hi there! In this AnyType video, I'll share 7 tips for organizing your people or contact list. Tip number 1. Create a new contact type. In AnyType Beta version 0.38, human is a locked type, meaning you cannot edit the title or delete it from your AnyType library. So if you don't want to use it, just make sure you are on the Types page of the library and start typing in this bar. Then select Create New Type. To get the circle image, change the recommended layout to Profile. Tip number two, categorize contacts into types. While you can have all your contacts categorized as one type, I recommend grouping your contacts into multiple types. In this example, with one human type, when I used a link relation, the list would be super long. However, if I have two types, human and faculty, I can now limit to show only faculty and my list is much shorter. Tip number three, split names for flexible sorting. The sorting feature in any type uses the first character in an object title. This means it will sort alphabetically by first name only if a name is entered like this, Harry Potter. If you want to sort by other parts of a name, I recommend creating separate relations for first name, last name, middle name, and title or honorific. This way, the full name of the contact stays the same, but I can now sort my contacts alphabetically by last name or surname. Tip number four, create a relation for consistency. A relation is similar to a property or attribute of an object. The select relation type allows you to create several choices just like a drop down menu. This is especially helpful for titles and honorifics such as Mr., Miss, or Doctor. Check out my tutorial on drop down choices linked above and in the video description. Tip number five, use a page template as a form. When creating a new contact in any type, the default page layout is usually blank. To create a form, click the arrow next to the New button to show templates. Then create a new template and add formatting and relations to it. Don't forget to set this as the default so that your form displays whenever you click the New button. Tip number six, a warning about page templates. Page templates only work for new objects they cannot be applied to existing objects. So I recommend finalizing your page template as much as possible before you create a lot of new contacts. One workaround for applying a page template to existing objects is to copy a page template and paste it on the blank page of an existing object. As you can see here, even though I copied from Draco's profile, when I copied and pasted it into Hermione's, it did not move Draco's information. It pulled the information from Hermione's object. Tip number seven, expect a multiplayer update soon. At the time of recording this video, multiplayer is not available yet. This multiplayer feature will allow you to collaborate with other users within the AnyType app. So if you already have a contact in any type, you will probably have to update that once the multiplayer feature has gone live. 